Welcome back everyone to Piney Plays of Brawler where today we are running a mission to destroy a couple of obelisks it looks like. And this one has us going against these signature deep waters. And let's just get rid of that disease there. So that's sort of the thing to worry about here. We have all these diseases. We've got the dread. So good thing I remembered last episode to get the glass into place. Not too sure if I really wanted to interrupt that one, but there you go. We had to get through all of these deep waters. Ah, I was wondering how I was going to get by the deep waters. All right, there you go. They came to me. But I guess if one of them wants to go underwater, I could, I could just l let him do it. Good. Now let's take care of the obelisk so that we won't have to worry about that doing because that's my mission here is to destroy two of these things if you can get by the deep waters it's a nice quick one if the uh, if the deep waters give you trouble well that's uh, another matter yeah I know I not too sure I really needed to kill this one, but might as well get some practice here. And uh, we've got. Yeah, if I, when I get close enough in order to try to do something to them. Hey, what if I pummel this one? Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, there you go. Nothing like pummeling one of these guys. Yeah, give me time to heal. Well, I'm not going to go right after that guy because I'll just go after the obelisk. I think that the... What does this obelisk thing have here? Aura healing spores. This aura heals nearby fungal creatures. Fungal creatures? What? These things aren't fungal. <laughs> hey, really? What use is a healing ability if you don't have anything of the type being healed nearby? I mean, really? That... Let's get out of here. These people are crazy. Next, we'll try the last embers of Nurse Grashu, which is when I try to remember what this one's about. I'm sure I'll remember as I go through because there are a couple of these where, yes, as you do the mission, you remember what it's about, but you're not too sure beforehand. Let's see, there are. Right, so I'm pretty. Do I have to fight all three of those at once? I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to fight at least two of these, right? And now we got these guys here. Okay, not too bad. Good. Now, what have we got? Is this the one where you have to find the key? Or is that, some, or is that a different one? See, it. I'm trying to remember all 80 missions is probably not, especially since I haven't done too many of these recently. Right, let's clear out this end. This place is full of archers. Ugh. Bane of the brawler, I'm pretty sure, because well-disciplined archers can be a little bit of a problem. Oh. Actually, I think that there is a... Is this... Is this one with those sappers? Yes, this is the one with the sappers in it. Yeah. Okay. 
let's see. I need to feed a Drogush in... Right. Okay, I, I heard that. Oh, oh. Unfortunately, the other... There, there are two sappers there. And only one of them was... Really troubled by that little bit of a problem. Actually, let me... Is I think it's the toughest area in this particular mission. Oh, okay. Looks like the other direction is just there for decoration. Let me get by here where I'm not going to be burning up. And be okay, good. Now, let me get back to full health and then we could take care of... And take care of this guy. And judiciously use my interrupts. Mission complete. Well. I think that's the first time I remember to go... I think usually I go in the other direction, which kills a lot of extra mobs, but... Slows down the... Mission quite a bit. Right? The throne of Tharazar. Uh, let's see. We need to get through here with the gate mechanism. This is actually one that I was thinking of when I... Uh-oh! This one also seems to feature sappers in it. Oh, no, actually, these are the saboteurs. Oh, the saboteur! I, I got him really early. Well, that could make the whole thing a lot faster. <laughs> Alright, I've got the saboteur who has the... So I can open up the gate. Usually I find the saboteur down this way. Hmm. How about just... Kill him for good measure before going in. Otherwise, this would be the shortest run of this... Mission ever. The saboteur right next to the right next to the gate mechanism. Uh, well, let's just head up here. Getting up here is pretty easy. I think it's the boss fight here where things can get a little messy. Actually, I think in the next, it, if you go to the room where I usually find the saboteur, he's Things might get a little dicey and... Oh, hello, I missed you! Go, and now... Uh, just a pair of warriors. I can take care of one little pair of warriors. Can it? Oh, actually, it's a... Uh... Oh! Oh, okay, okay, okay! That's a little bit more than I was expecting! <laughs> Alright. Turn you into a punching bag. And now for you. Okay, that got a little dicey quickly. Now, let's see, it's a... Uh, hmm. Well, just so I could heal up a little faster. I am trying to use up all these Dillman's cramps that I've got. Oh, actually, let's just go in and punch him so that I can... Do the maximum damage right at the start. Kick you. There you go. Hey, what happens if I pummel him? Boom, 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 boom. There you go. Ooh. That worked out. Now. Where is the... I would have thought that the dwarf would have come here, seeing that this is where you... ...have to defeat the boss anyway. Let's get out of here! This one is in Kaivitsar, and things are a little bit more complicated for this particular... ...one, including things like corruptions. Which I have to take into account. Fortunately, I do have Helm's Hammer to help get rid of corruptions. I just don't know if 
I remember it because I'm not used to fighting against corruptions on the brawler. So I have to take that into account. Of course, if I kill him before he could finish casting the corruption, all the better. Looks like these early ones, they are in easy enough to do. I think there are some tougher mobs up ahead. Let's see, I need to destroy 12 standards, defeat lesser watching stones, and challenge the spirits inside of watching stones. Alright, I think I need to head upstairs now. But this tower has. Oh, speaking of challenge it yeah there you go yeah these are signatures can I yeah no of course I can't kick in in time because I have my reaction time too slow all right now let's get this one so standards we should get plenty of those up too much with the I try to remember if these things are always in the same place or if they tend to move. I think they tend to move. Uh, which, in this case, in that case, my reaction time's fine, but the thing was on cooldown. All right, really should have changed because I do have the. Oh, hello! Now we get two at a time. I th I thought things get a little bit more complicated as you go along here, and which. Oh, everything was on cooldown. What, I actually got her in time? Good grief. Ah. Oh. Or maybe she had some... Sometimes... I think I was just so used to the ones that summon ghosts that I was thinking that's what she did. Maybe she just puts a buff on herself. Alright, now what do we have next? Well, that's to go. Oh, there is a stone here to challenge. Hello. Headbutt. Okay. Hey, I actually got two interrupts off on the same mob. Maybe there's hope for me yet. Next. Boom. And now it's your turn. Pow. Alright. I don't know where the last of the stones is, but I guess I'll find those soon enough after I take care of these. Hey! Quit interrupting me! And now it's your turn. But now, let's take care of that. Oh, I did destroy that other banner first. Okay. Good. No one there? Oh, here's the last one right over here. Challenge time. Your turn. She. I'll j just stun it so that it won't do anything for a little while here. I'm not too sure what a kick in the knee cast would do to a ghost, but okay. Oh! There you go. That time I did get her in time. Alright, let's see. Now the trouble is that... Oh, well, I guess there is no trouble. Is that it? Did I clear out the entire tower? Uh, no, there, there are a couple of warriors around here still. Like the one behind this flag. Surprise! Okay, maybe two of them behind the flag.
Yeah, I am completely forgetting about the corruption. <laughs> Don't you? I will most likely forget to take out the corruptions. There you go. There's <laughs> Helm's hammer with a kick? <laughs> really? Helm's hammer. Coming upon seeing you, you refuse corruption, corruption removal. Okay, okay. I wasn't expecting that to be a kick. Bit of a kick in the face. Alright, there you go. And I will presume that he's downstairs because I have finished all of my objectives for this particular one and then back down to here how about that I managed to get four missions done in the episode I think that works out pretty well actually let's make it five this time I need to deal with some worms Actually, this is a good mission if you're playing in... Oops, there you go. Actually, maybe not. I was, I was thinking it might be a good one for elves, but I think they need drakes, not worms, for their class quest. Or their class deed. So, nip. Racial deed, yes. There, there's a word there somewhere. All right. All right, let, let's deal with... Oh, some of these are... Signatures, aren't they? Okay. And now it's your turn. I just need to find some dwarves and rescue them. Whee! Well, while my armor clears out and my healing gets done, I might as well buff up a little bit. Got them over there. So, Alright, so the ones that... So the whitish ones, they seem to be the more dangerous ones at the moment. Now, I think I saw... Ah, oh, yes, I see a, some quest rings around here. One of these is right up here. Oh, there's a dwarf hiding right here. No, don't be scared of me. I'm only a hobbit. Hey, I'm very glad to see you. Good. Now you're glad to see me. And here's the second one. Here we go. Time for a rescue. You're welcome. And now... The third one. Let's... Bring out this... Vicious cold worm first. And... Knock him out a little bit. Okay, that's number three. I must admit, I really don't remember this one all that well. I remember the other one where you're trying to capture the flags here with the hobgoblins, but rescuing the the dwarves from the worms, I I didn't remember about this one. But it looks like oh, once I got back in here, I had no trouble taking care of them. Good. And a rescue over there. Well, looks like I've got to get through the... Oh, that's right, the toughest one about the missions in this area is always finding your way back. Right. <laughs> Using the worm as a punching bag. Oh, boy. That's... That's really, yes. I'm definitely going the wrong way. Oh, well. I think this is, yes, this is the exit. Five missions completed in 20 minutes. I think that's a pretty good record right over there. And with that, we conclude our episode. We'll see what we'll do next time. Maybe we could finally head out into the Lone Lands and find out where we can find Radagast when we return to 
Piney plays the Brawler. <laughs> 